no, it wasn't worth it. Not now. Um, the only way to get back to where we were is if you obviously went back, spent another 20 years there, another 40 billion, lost another 450 of people's lives, another million of me, people's mental health gone down a pan. That's the only way to get it back. And obviously we're not going to do that. So how can I say it was, was worth it? It may have been 13 years since Ben McBean served in Afghanistan, but his life-changing injuries are a permanent reminder of his time there. He says seeing the country fall to the Taliban in recent days has been very hard to watch. Being, being in my position to be it's is hard work, um, but if you've got that little bit of, oh, it's for a reason kind of thing, then you don't really mind. When I think about it and go back, all I can think about is when I was in Kajaki, when I was doing my bit there, um, and where we were, we didn't see the marketplaces and things like that, but you knew guys were back there doing a good job. So no matter where you were, it's collectively, we are all doing a really good job. And now you just see all of this chaos, all this fear. It's just, yeah, it's hard to, to take in. How surprised are you at the speed at which the Taliban has taken major cities? When I first saw the images, I kind of thought, I missed something, like, we won the war kind of thing, because Afghanistan's not been on TV for ages. Turns out we literally just left. So one day we're kind of there, the next minute we're gone. We've just unlocked the door to the Taliban and said, welcome, and they've just come in and trashed everything. Yeah, this picture here, I remember this one again. I think this is just after I sat down from getting my medal. During his time in Afghanistan, Ben experienced highs and lows. One of those highs was meeting Prince Harry on a plane heading to hospital, with Harry hailing him a hero. But Ben now feels far from heroic. He wanted to tell his son about his injuries and how they were worth the pain. But he says, given recent events, that's now changed. If he asks when he's older, which I know he will, or his friends will, um, I, I was not looking forward to, but waiting for this bit where, oh, what happened was like 50 years ago I went to war and it was chaos, but we, we calmed it all down and now the people can go to school, like you go to school, I went to school and la da 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 and kind of give that message um, when I've done public speaking and I've said, you know, yeah, we went out there, we're doing a good job, and then it's all just gone.